Welcome to Boatshed.com. Uh, we're now down below on this Tomahawk 25 sailing boat. Just looking at the aft crew cabin, uh, which currently houses uh, six uh, recently purchased fenders. They are all included. And just panning around, we can see the windows, which are in pretty good order. A few scuffs on them, but given the age of the boat, they haven't crazed and they are fully serviceable. They're also dry which is always a big bonus when you're sailing English waters. Nicely dressed uh, and includes a fold-out table. So two leaves to give yourself plenty of space, but also when folded away, it doesn't overly get in the way. And we're just going to move forward. Firstly, on the starboard side, we have the heads. If you give the dodgy cam work here. Uh, which is a standard sea toilet. This was put in about a year ago. Um, pretty basic, but you know, clean, tidy, no smells, which is always a big plus. And then we come round into the forward cabin with the storage shelf. And dressed nicely, and in front of that is obviously the anchor locker, plenty of anchor chain included. And then as we come back, little shaving stroke makeup mirror there and light and good storage, hanging space that goes through down below. And then another one for boots, etc. And then we come through into the galley. Now the galley has a manual water system supplied by a bag in the bow. And it also has a two burner paraffin stove. And this then folds down, if I just remove that, just to allow additional prep space. And then we move to, uh, I suppose the nav station. We have a table which folds up, underpinned underneath. You'll see plenty of safety equipment, flares, etc. but I would assume they are out of date. But it does come with a VHF with DSE that's less than a year old. The better marine controls, complete with a volt and amp meter, and the instrument panel. And then another crew cabin, uh, currently housing a couple of cushions for the cockpit, an additional um, sort of cigarette lighter attachment with USB just for convenience. Battery is underneath where there are pictures on boat shed. And then we see the engine has an automatic bilge, tread plates, also one on the next step up, but that's been removed so we can see the better marine 14 horsepower engine, which has done approximately 260 hours. Lots of pictures on Boatshed. Uh, if you'd like more information, please do get in touch. I'd be delighted to talk you through it.